call it kind of bridging this gap. So genuine interest, authentic relationship, which results in price clients. But when I'm talking about a gap, I think where I see a lot of salespeople struggle is we put our customers up here, right? The hotel owner, the architect, the principal, we have all these high profile clients and then our sales colleagues, us, competitors, other industries, we're all kind of down here and we're all trying to like jump up to this owner. But the gap that we're trying to bridge is to basically put us in alignment with our clients. Like anytime you go into networking events, something like this, uh, a sales call, you want to have an intentional outcome coming out of it, both for your own fueling your own business forward, because that's what we're in this industry to do. But also, what are you bringing to the table that's of value? Because that's what's going to put us on the same level. Because not only are we leaving like relationship opportunity on the table, but from a sales capacity, we leave money on the table a lot. And Brian, his colleague, comes up to me and just starts talking to me about this bathtub that's in their booth. Oh, it's made with this material. It holds X gallons of water. It's eleven thousand dollars. Brian, in what world do you think I can afford this tub? I'm a renter in LA. I'm just going to say hi to my friend, but like he didn't ask me any of those questions. Didn't even look at my badge. He just went into. I like, get it. We all get into autopilot mode at trade shows. Yeah. But really, at the end of the day, he didn't show any interest in me. Just threw up all over me with product facts <laughs> that I did not care about. Wasted our time and wasted his energy. But when we put this business spin on it, we're going to start to put deposits into our clients' bank accounts. And then we can start withdrawing. And that's where the pivot point is. I like to do a little inventory of where I'm at with like the state of the account. Yeah. Mark runs the studio. He reports directly to the boss. He's a big guy. I need to get in with Mark. Like that, he's going to be one of my targets. As we bridge that gap, we're going to take from price clients to price relationships. And that's how we're on the same level, right? We're a consultant. We're not a salesperson. But, you know, we're up here with these clients because we're building things together.